Welcome back folks. This is lesson 198 and I thought, uh, oh, it's not here, we're in September, it's not here. I just, I just had the urge to do, to do a, a bit of a winter scene. So that's what we're getting today. It might be a bit early, but uh, bear with me. Let, 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 I'd, I'd like to do one and we'll see how it goes. So the colours today are the, the ones I usually use. That's the raw sienna, ultramarine, ultramarine plus burnt umber, less the same colour, and a weak mix of alizarin. So that that's that's all I need to start me off. I'm, I can twiddle on with bits on, on, on other things later on in the painting. But first of all, let, let's get cracking on the painting, shall we? Now the light today is coming from the right, I'd say. Yeah, let's have it from the right. So we'll, we'll put a bit of a sky in first and get, get, get some of this white. I know I, I want white today because it's, it's a, a winter scene, but uh, but let's uh, let's just pop a sky in. Don't forget the light's coming from this side. Touch of sunshine in that sky. This is a raw sienna. See the the jets from Lake Neath are on time again. As soon as I start, they start. Not too bad. Right. Touch of blue in there. Touch of blue, that's ultramarine. Now we'll have some, uh, I think we're on that, touch of that alizarin in the, in the, on the horizon there. Number 20, this brush I'm using, by the way, it's, it's, a, it's a lovely brush. It, uh, I've had it for a year, well, I've got two or three of them for years, and, and I'd love to use them on, 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 on situations like this with just, just, just have a dip with a point and it, 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 it'll, it'll serve you well. So if you think about if you, your partner or wherever it is, that fancy buying you something, this is a, a nice addition, number 20. It's nice to have a, a bit of a sky. And I think now we'll have some, a bit of a, a dark Darken it down a bit, this, this lovely scene. A bit of a cloud cover up here. This is the ultramarine and burnt umber mixed. There we go with it. That's just the distance there. I'm just separating it from the sky. I think so to do it out of there. I might just experiment a little bit and just take a little bit out of this. this. There. A bit more dark in this corner. We'll balance that that heavy weight of buildings down here. Of 
course, the next thing you, I must tell myself is stop fiddling, stop fiddling. You, 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 you get bogged down and then you, oh, I'll do it, just another fiddle here and another fiddle there. And before you know, you've beaten the sky to death. I don't want to do that. Well, that's dry now, folks. So <coughs> I thought what we'd try now is, is take it from uh, sort of there's a distant hillside here, coming that way, and then we'll paint that bit in first, and then there'll be, there'll be snow covered, of course, but but in the distance it'll not look snowy, will it? It'll, it'll look, it'll have a sort of a a distant look about it. Sure, they use these jets, but blimey, they certainly use lots of them. It's usually Tuesdays they come. I thought it'd be alright today, but they've got me. Unless it's Tuesday, it oh, it's Tuesday, isn't it? <laughs> That's probably why. I remember all, all at sea whether the, 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 the our dear old Queen had been put to rest and, and everything going pear shaped. But not to worry, we'll get there. So that 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 hopefully will send that back a bit. I, I don't want it to be, be too. There's there's marks on this sort of thing. I put marks on the thing and have it have a bit of lift some of the paint out of there and have a bit of distance on it. This is just clean water, just. Give it a bit of an idea. Right, we'll start this. These these uh, hills here, they, they, these are sort of uh, coming closer to us, so we'll, 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 we'll put a bit of colour on it. I don't want it to look just just white. It's uh, it'd, be, it'd be wrong to be just white. It, it, it's it, it's a bit distant. We'll see what we can get. Get down with this. So snow isn't always white. Picks up lots of surrounding light and stuff like that. So we're coming a bit closer now. And put a bit of shadow on there from that. Right, so we'll, I don't want to do too much down there. Well, the sun, the sun's catching it from down here, so I'll put a bit of sunshine in there as well. So don't kill it altogether. This is some nice sunshine coming into here. Of course, we get a bit of 
some cheddar crust here as well. Right, that's dry now. Let's uh, tattle this foam out, shall we? Uh, raw sienna to give it a base colour there on the stonework. Up in the Yorkshire Dales there. Just pop some colour into it. I've, I've, I've masked out the, uh, the roof and that. Just protect it a little bit. I think one of my there's, there's, a, there's a stone wall in front of it just there, so I'll just pop that in just to. Bit of a gate there. Go down there into that like a little little ballot there. It's going like that and then like this. I think we've we've covered all the all the bases there. How about the chimneys. Right, we'll dry that off a bit now. Well, that's dry now. I think we, before we go any further, on this, I'll, I'll just indicate the separations on, on these fields a bit at the back. Uh, before I come back, this is this is the uh, French ultramarine and, and, and burnt umber, a mix of that. Just a nice dark to, to sort of, it, it gives some separation in, in walls and things like that. Just get a sort of a, a finish brush and. It's only a squiggle. That's going up the hillside there. Top of that one there. I'm not concentrating here, so it's just to give our sort of place a bit of, bit of lift. Separation. I want to, uh, I want to I might just suggest there and find the right brush on for it. There we are, I've got it. And put the nothing special, but just break the horizon.
I thought, well, I'm going, uh, I thought that, well, I would tree behind the, behind the house there as well. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? If we pop one down, down about here, it'll, it'll, it'll do it quite nice, I think. I looked at it and it would make it up as I go along. The beauty of that is, you can't get it wrong because you, you, you haven't made it up yet. That's the beauty of it. Mind you, if it could pear shape, it's down to you. So be careful what you make up. Bushing in with this, I'll, I'll try that, see what happens. Then take it off me. Right, I said just a suggestion of a sort of branch formation in, in, in this tree here, or this bush I think it is. I made a bush then, then I thought, oh, we'll give it one, two little bits and pieces coming out of it. I'll take this this masking fluid off the off the, off the roof of this this building here. Well, I've taken the masking fluid off now. Let, let's let's just give them a bit of. Uh, see, the light's coming from the right, isn't it? So we, we'll 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 get some. Some indications of dark on on the on the sides away from the light, won't we? Keep it. That's it. There'll be some under there. That side of the chimney pot. There'll be some on the end of that. And underneath this the snow laying on top. And 
this one's face here will be in shade. underneath the, the deep snow there will be shadow from the light up there Sh shadow on the snow gives you shadow on the on the actual building itself right let's uh, now there's one here a roof here that one's a, you'll see this snow on the underside just here That's about it on that one. You'll see a shadow under there and one under there. Uh, this building here, we'll see shadow under that eave there. And under the level of snow that's on the roof here. Uh, I think we ought to have a, one or two windows in. Oh, they're going to see nothing. Don't you agree? I think so, anyway. Windows. Let's get some one or two windows in. One or one or two in here. And little slashes there. One in the gable end there. Probably see wind, one window there. Makes it look more lived in now. Let's put one or two in these barns down here. I'll put a, a gateway in there, sort of a panel in. A window. A door in here. Another door, uh, an opening. The end of that, and the other window in here. I think there's enough window and put on the one here. I'll slip this gate in, this gate one's popping in, doesn't it? And this this is there's a wall going across here and there's a gate in here. Cross members here. Right, that should do the, the gate. Bit of warm. 
something here. Just a bit of uh, bushiness coming out of it. I'm not fitting. One or two bits of dark on this wall here, stone wall. You can't put them all in the stones, but, but at least you can just indicate a few. Dry stone walling. Phenomenal, the way it's been done over the years. The patience, it must have taken these lads to do it. I was saying, uh, the light is from the from the right, so I was going to just suggest uh, this and this, this shade here. It's going to cast a shadow down here, isn't it? This bulb. to have a, a lovely cloud shadow across this foreground here that would be lovely wouldn't it just a, the sunshine there but a touch of, I think I'll have a touch of pink in there as well nice to have some pink on there coming from the sky picking that up Soft skylight there. Let's try now. Uh, let's have a look. It, it, it's a bit bare. I might, you wouldn't get just a feel of that. I think you'd get a little bit twiggery in it, wouldn't you? So let, let's just put a bit, a bit of, sort of this sort of stuff in it. Just as it's... It's 
a little bit in there. Bit of dark in there as well. It's even some casting a shadow. What have you fancy doing? It's, it's, it's a, a nice little bit of time for twiddle. Just to uh, have a bit of fun if you like, just, just before you close it up. And beat it to death. It's nice to, it's nice to have a fiddle. I'm a twiddle, not a fiddle. We don't, we don't, we don't, we don't fiddle. Hopefully. What we're trying to create there is, is, uh, is the, the appearance that, that you're looking over this, you sit on this bank here, or overlooking the, the field, or coming into, in the distant farm there. So, so that, that, that's, that's, that's the thing. It's, it, it's killed off this, this foreground bit quite nicely. It, uh, cause it, it was a bit too big for what I wanted it. But uh, there again, it, it will it will it will cast a nice shadow this here across here. put a spot of red in on my painting just to, just to draw the eye into the into the picture now I've got to think where to put a spot of red because it's important it's got to be in the right place now we can what we can do is put it as a There. I can put it, I think, just here. So, so it's a barn, this, so, so you might get a suggestion of a, a red tractor just here. Don't, 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 don't put bells and whistles on it, just it's a, it's a, a suggestion. That, that there's, there's something there that's that's giving it a, a bit of colour. That's all. Now I'll just close it down with a, with a bit of a mount and see what it looks like. See if it's any better. So that, that's how how Yorkshire farmhouse there. Uh, it's in the Yorkshire Dales. Beautiful country. I know I'm a Yorkshire man, biased, but, uh, but that, that's that, that's how it is. It, it is now. The twiddle on that. So uh, until next time, folks. Th th that's it. It's uh, I've enjoyed that. It's a change from what we've been doing, and I'll see you on the next one. So until then, folks. It's goodbye. Goodbye, folks. <laughs>